The overall goal of this video protocol is to demonstrate complete multi-step photolithography of microfluidic master molds with on-chip valves and multiple height features tunable for any application. This method is a complete overview for how to fabricate master molds with complex geometries, including on-chip membrane valves for microfluidic devices. The main advantage of this technique is that it makes it possible to easily control flow in microfluidic devices, overcoming a major barrier to entry to microfluidics and biological applications. Visual demonstration of this technique is critical, as the steps for photolithography are often difficult for beginners to master. Proper alignment, development, and exposure rely on visual cues and cleanroom experience. To begin, design your device and prepare the individual photo masks for the multi-layer geometries. Additionally, prepare about four wafers with a 5 micron layer of SU82050 negative photoresist and flood expose as described in the accompanying text protocol. Place the coated wafer on a spin coater and turn on the vacuum to affix it to the spin chuck. Use nitrogen or compressed air to blow away any dust from the surface. Then, apply 2-3 milliliters of AZ50XT positive photoresist to the center of the wafer. Spin coat the photoresist to create a 55 micron layer. Once coated, lay down the wafer carefully in a 5 inch petri dish and let relax for 20 minutes. Next, soft bake the wafer on a hot plate for 22 minutes while ramping the temperature from 65 degrees Celsius to 112 degrees Celsius at a rate of 450 degrees Celsius per hour. Then, remove the wafer and let it rest overnight at room temperature in a petri dish for ambient...